Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Would you have the clerk report House Committee Substitute 1? Clerk, please report. House Committee Substitute 1 to House Bill 500. General from Nelson. Move adoption. Motion is for the adoption of House Committee Substitute 1. Is there any discussion? Seeing none, those in favor signify by voting aye. aye. Those opposed, nay. House Committee Substitute 1 is adopted. General from Nelson. Mr. Speaker, um, House Bill 500, as modified by House Committee Substitute 1, fixes a couple of problems that our bourbon industry has been facing. I don't know if many of you know, I'm from Bardstown. We're the bourbon capital of the world. That's trademarked. Um, we, <laughs> hey, we got the trademark, I'm telling you. <laughs> the, uh, one, of the, one of the neat things about Bardstown and other places in Kentucky is these, our distilleries have been offering private barrel selects. And it's a program where you can come to the distillery, kind of get into the warehouse, go with the, the master distiller, pick out some barrels, and maybe do your own private label bottle if you want, give it away as a gift or whatever. The ABC has indicated that, that they believe we need to fix the language in the statute to clarify that this is something that can continue. And as you might imagine, this is a very big draw on the Bourbon Trail. We get almost two million visitors a year that come to Kentucky go on the bourbon trail and this is one of the things they they love to do so what house bill 500 does is it fixes the private barrel select program make sure that we're going to continue to do that and then along the lines of economic development and tourism it does a couple other things number one it allows a distillery to sell a specialty bottle that you can only get at the distillery making visitors want to come back to kentucky that, that have been on the bourbon trail it also allows our distilleries to open up a satellite tasting room, but, but just one. And, and the reason for that, I'll share this, I shared it with the committee. Um, traveling around the country, if you've ever been to California and gone to wine country, there's a little town, Carmel by the Sea, I think uh, Clint Eastwood was their mayor. But Carmel has wineries all over the place, but when you go downtown, all of the wineries have a tasting room lined up, boom, 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 all there together. And so it's kind of a one-stop shop where folks can come and experience a lot of different things. For me, in Nelson County, I wish that would happen for Bardstown. And we've got a lot of craft distillers that are out throughout our state. They could now come and open a tasting room in Bardstown and have some of those 1.8 million visitors get to sample their products and maybe grow their customer base. It also allows our, our, distri our distillers to present at fairs and festivals, just like the beer and wine guys get to do. And, and the last thing it does is allows for um, batched cocktails. I don't know if you've been to a bar or restaurant lately, you might have seen up on the bar barrel-aged old fashions. Turns out that may not be legal, <laughs> so we want to make sure that it is. Now, when I presented this bill in committee, there was some opposition. And a couple of the committee members said, boy, I sure would like you to get together with the distributors and the retailers and see if we can't fix some of these things. So, Mr. Speaker, would you have the clerk report House Floor Amendment 2? Clerk, please report. House Floor Amendment 2 to House Bill 500. General Nelson. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. House Floor Amendment 2, we took your all's advice. We got together with the distributors, got together with the retailers. And I'm proud to report that maybe, I don't know that I've ever said these words on the House floor, the distributors are in favor of House Bill 500 with House Floor Amendment 2. The retailers are officially neutral, but some of them, including Westport Whiskey and Wine and Party Source, and, and there's a bunch of others, are absolutely in favor of this bill. So we have the entire three-tier system realizing that growing this bourbon pie for everybody is a positive thing. I would like to move for the adoption of House Floor Amendment 2. Motion is for the adoption of House Floor Amendment 2. Is there any discussion? Seeing none, those in favor signify by voting aye. aye. Those opposed nay. House Floor Amendment 2 is adopted. General from Nelson. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Just want to say thank you to the industry partners in all three tiers for working on this with me, for getting a good bill that I think helps everybody. And with that, I would like to move adoption of House Bill 500 as amended by House Committee Substitute 1 and House Floor Amendment 2. Question 